Be sure to check out In My Shoes, the film and the documentary. It will change your life. My name is Caleb Davis. Uh, currently, right now, we're on the island of Lesbos in Greece, the home to Dimitri, the composer of this project, a really good friend. I went to school in London, and we're just out here vacationing and also just, you know, doing some post-op work on the uh, In My Shoes project. In My Shoes was um, a project that uh, really came to me about a year ago. Um, when I was working at KTLA Studios in Los Angeles, I, um, I would always watch the news and see, you know, problems that happen internationally and also problems that happen, you know, domestically, socially in the city of Los Angeles. And I wanted to just basically compare and contrast the lives of first world teens and third world teens and just give an audience a, a wide view of the different lifestyles out there for, you know, possible change in the future taking place in Studio City, right across from NBC Universal, and we had the opportunity to just, you know, cast a wide spread of actors and actresses from all across the Los Angeles area. So that was incredible just to have that space and the opportunity to see the various different talents that wanted to go pursue. Mohamed Bangura, and he actually got me the opportunity to connect with his team, Bamber United, to cast the actors which were players of his team. So I was able to utilize that platform and cast over about a dozen, a handful of uh, boys to actually be part of that film. It was really fun, it was really exciting. It was actually a learning experience. Um, anytime that I get to do an international project, it's not just me going there, documenting it, you know, giving it my vision, but it's also me learning about the cultures, me learning about you know, everything that the land has to offer for the film. This right here, I'm gonna put another question mark on it. There were certain barriers of just going inside the slums, you know, just, you know, trying to avoid like, you know, bugs, mosquitoes or any wildlife that might, you know, affect the, the crew and myself. But um, other than the slums, other than, you know, you know, you know, the actual pro production itself, it was still amazing to be in Sierra Leone. Samba! Yes, mom! <laughs> the challenges for this film to overcome was, um, you know, it was definitely like, uh, you know, uh, finances, you know, I had to basically work even uh, 10 times harder, whether it was, you know, just doing jobs to, to, to complete the mission, you know, travel, or whether it was extra work, just, you know, uh, going out to the world, letting them know that I, what I wanted to do and help and support, um, family support, friend support, and just, you know, people that believed in me and my vision support um, was definitely something that, you know, helped me overcome to actually get to this point to make, to complete it because it, it was something big. A lot of people say, you know, it's not enough time, you know, you, you know, that's too much, it's a lot, you know, but at the same time to actually see the actual product finish and um, uh, just see what everybody said that wasn't possible to make it possible that, you know, that really means a lot. Yeah, it feels amazing. <laughs> probably, probably this one, you start strong and then it kind of dies down. And, you know, the template, it will definitely be magnified in the future. Um, you know, for me, a humanitarian, uh, charitable causes to other countries, not just Africa, but um, uh, an actual template, to, you know, for film to just show different international film styles, but still giving an entertaining approach. Um, a, a template in which, you know, to show documentary filmmaking of the land where the production took, took place. So um, this is a template uh, that will, you know, definitely be magnified for the future. Um, currently, you know, film festivals is, is definitely, you know, happening, it's a must. And uh, have some going on in Los Angeles, um, London for sure, scouting on the East Coast. So definitely gonna just, you know, get the In My Shoes world and project out there as much as possible. And, um, you know, only the future can tell. And uh, that's uh, what I'm really, really excited about.